Hi everyone, welcome back to Uncharted 4. So as you can see, we're young again. We are in a house that is basically like a museum. There's, it's full of stuff. And we're here with our brother Sam because we want to find our mom's diary and our mom's stuff in general. And we're apparently hoping to find that here. Hmm, it's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. I'll follow you. Or not. Hey, the air vent. Up there. Where are you? Oh, yeah. Oh. Huh. That could get us into the room below it. Not us. You. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can I handle it? All right. Let's see what you got then. I mean, the question is, how do I get up there? Can you help me, or...? Because I'm clearly too small to jump that. I guess... Okay, hold on a second. I see maybe a way to go. Here, check yep. this out. Up here. Why would we move that? Are you ready? Oops. Oh, cool. It's a Polaroid. Let me see. I think it still works. Come here. Now <laughs> smile, all right? Can't lose it. Come on. Here I go. Okay. Okay. Up here. Hey, don't fall. Never. Oh, okay. Oh, careful. Don't smash anything. These things are... so valuable. Claustrophobic. Okay, it's hard to see. What does a dead end? That is probably not a dead end. There we go. Yeah, it's also only a short trip through the vents. Locked yes. from this side too. No, really? Can't see anything yet. Some medication. Mm. Codeine. Lots of painkillers. Painkillers, yeah.
Evelyn, I was hoping I wouldn't have to write this letter. I was hoping our last conversation made my intentions clear. I was hoping that ignoring your repeated attempts to contact me would eventually send the right message. Discovering you send my daughter a check in the mail means the message was too subtle for someone like you. I don't need your money. And more to the point, I don't want your money. I can take care of my family just fine without your help. It's insulting to both of our intelligences to pretend that your hollow gesture would somehow rekindle our relationship. What little was left of our bond died the moment you couldn't bother to show up for Dad's funeral. Right up to the moment he drew his last breath, he still loved you. I don't. I pray you find peace with whatever it is you've been seeking your entire life, but do not contact me or my family again, Edmund. Well, that's yeah. sad. Mm. It is sad. That's them. There's the key. <coughs> yeah, if she couldn't even bother going to the funeral, it's sad. Oh, anything? Didn't no. see any journals. We still got the other locked door, so come on. Do anything with this one? Okay. What other locked door? There was a locked door here. Why did he go wow. down? Uh, journals galore. Jesus, yeah. Well, let's see what we find. If we find anything of value for us. Nope. So Peter and the Great and the Amber Room, Kolya Yukov, St. Petersburg State University. What are all these journals that she has there? Is that what people sent her or what? I mean, they're all written in the same um, handwriting. No. Viking, Viking Treasures of Vinland, Stephen Trembler, University of Toronto. Are these people she went on excursions with and therefore has the journals or what? Whoa. There we go. Maybe. Sandra M. Sam. Well, you got something? <laughs> Good lord. This is it. I just thought there was someone standing, but it was just a statue. Evelyn bought a first edition of A General History of the Pirates from a collector along with a stack of 18th century documents. Among them I found a very intriguing letter from one Joseph Burns, who, n who not only admits to being a crewman of Henry Avery's ship, but possibly hints at Avery's vast treasure. What else could riches of paradise refer to? If he sent this letter from prison, he clearly didn't have it, the treasure with him. So where is it? Need to trace it back to the source. Henry Avery's attack on the guns on the gunsway. The picture caption says Joseph Burns, and the map caption last known sighting. The note above letter. What are these markings? My dear son Richard. Can I not read that? Whoa. Henry Avery. Gunsway heist. Okay, I couldn't do anything, sorry. Oh, what do you got there? I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that... You know, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. <gasps> oh! 
Jeez, Slow, it's Evelyn. Hey, 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 there's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, 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 you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. It's not all your right, journal. Right. Unless you're old, Mom. I'm sorry, Nathan. She's not a little mother, she's way too old. So what now? Now, we wait. <sighs> the police? For the police. Mm. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... Jesus Christ, woman, I calm really down. I don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady, it was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. But not being killed for like step get getting into your yeah, house and looking through call. stuff. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's kids. stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Hmm. Yeah, that, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's voice. Yes. Uh. Hi. My God. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah, you're, you're still mine. So, uh, do you mind? <sighs> well, she should not smoke. I mean, uh, on the other hand, it's also at that point probably it doesn't matter that I have uh, the the little joy. You knew her mom. She worked for me. Mm. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> nah, that's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. Still of all hurts. her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Here. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Did you already call the police? That was quick. Yeah, sure. Uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, here. <sighs> Sorry about the mess. <laughs> Come on, Nathan. Let's go. Are you okay? Oh god, no. That's a bad that's some really bad timing, woman. Hey. 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 Stan? Ma'am? 
Damn it, that is to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. Terrible timing. It's nothing we can do for her. We have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Yeah, she already reported a a break in. That does not look good. Go, 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 go. Let's follow Sam. Hurry. Wait up. Everything just made out of like cardboard boxes in in this country and in any other country as well. Sam, I got you. Just jump. Like for God's sake, everything's breaking. The chimney. Come on. Come in. Jesus Christ, Nate, run faster. This way. I lost Sam. Let's get up there. Come on. Hurry. Not by much. I'd say we're clear, but we catch our breath for a second. Wasn't our fault back there. I mean, that lady, she. She was, she was old. Dumb. She was dead. Uh, she was uh, sick. sick and ill. Yeah. I mean, it's okay to feel bad, but there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? 
Hmm. Okay, I see. I Back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. Until tonight, I didn't know what that meant. But this... Mom's unfinished work. This is our chance to restart our lives. With brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name... Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? So we don't even know that, we just... You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. We just took and that I identity. Promise, you and me, together? We're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? Wow. Everything changed after that. You know, we became explorers, adventurers, mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. You know, for a while it felt like, you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. And you know, after I lost him, I after I thought I lost him. You didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. Well, that's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. <laughs> but... It's a start. It's a lot. I'd love to know what you're thinking. I'm thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. Yes. Yeah. I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. <coughs> it would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> well, I mean, how did you get here? Sully. Oh, of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive. Par for the course. And now we just need to rescue the other Drake. I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. Yeah, I wasn't missing. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got him. Oh, shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah. They're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar... No, there is no Alcazar. Shit. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean... the dip, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you, okay? Yeah, I can't wait. Look, you two be safe down there. You know us. Jaja. Thanks. Sure? No, I mean... Thanks for saving me. Again. I almost didn't this time. Yeah. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. So, we're headed to the northern side of the island? Yeah, New Devon, home to the founders of Libertalia. And that's what better that was. The treasure's probably there. Just need to save Sam before they find it. 
can't believe he lied to us. I'm still so angry at him. Look. Yeah. Up there. I borrowed it from your shoreline friends. You slid all the way down from there? Yeah, the quickest way to get down to you. Now we just gotta figure out another way back up. It's here. Yeah, here. I'm glad that Elena came back, but yeah, I could have understood um, if she wouldn't have. So, have you been here long? On the island? A few hours now. Did you see the colony? I did, from the air. Pretty incredible, right? I didn't get the full tour. I was a little preoccupied with finding you. Right. So, did uh, Sully fill you in on the deal with this place? Yep. Henry Avery, 400 million, 12 founders, hundreds of colonists. Something like that. Yeah, that just about covers it. Had some time to go on the flight over. Wow. Is that an elevator? Sure looks, looks like, like it. it. I swear Avery recruited the best engineers of his time. He must have used it to move supplies upriver. Yeah, that's a fair bet. I don't think they're supposed to use it just yet, if at all. Nice grab, Nathan. Oh. I'll give him that, he's probably still a bit... Um, There's an opening up there. There's your car. Just need to get up there. Well, what do you think? Which way? Well, let's take a look. Well, up there. I'm oh, sorry, Elena. Um, what was I saying? And it wasn't important. How do we get up there? Oh, there's a ladder. Look at that. There we go. I can boost you up there. Great. Uh oh. Hurry, 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 hurry. Yep. Hey, do you think there's another way up? Uh Hey, I see a path up here. There's a way through over there. See if you can find something I can use. Yep. Yeah, because I mean I see roughly hey, I well. Found something. Hold on. Yeah, wonderful. Thank you. That's exactly what I need. Huh? Can we, like, retract the rope? Okay. Is that... Opala? Is that enough? Yeah, 
before. Nice, hey, jump. nice jump. Not bad, right? Not Wait bad at all. It's a girl like that off. Idiot. Yeah, exactly. Come on, I'll meet you around. Funny. Treasure. How am I supposed to grab that treasure? Oh, dear. Everything's under control. See if you can get back up here. Yeah. Yeah, roger that. Nate, can you find a way out of there? Looks like a dead end. Well, maybe the elevator still works. I doubt it. 300 years old. Been exposed to the weather, and who knows if it ever... Got it. Oh, look. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Going up? <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. It is so bright, I can hardly see anything. You know, I'll just uh, meet you at the top, I guess. God. Nothing to it. Okay, that was subtle. Now then, which way is the car? It'll be easier to spot from higher ground. Right. Good idea. This whole thing is powered by the water wheel down there. It's quite a feat for a bunch of pirates. It is. The thing is that they are just scattered around the place, these dudes. They could be anywhere. Oh, we're getting some exercise at least, right? <laughs> All right. Okay, I think we're going this way. And judging by the tall grass. Shoreline. Yep. You found your car. Technically, oh, yeah. So, so let's get back. There. Okay. We want to have tall grass.
Whoop. Whoop. Down you go. Come on over. Are you good there? Do you want to come over and check it out? <sighs> Alright then. Uh, I'm not so comfortable with this position here because we do not have any tall grass that we can get to. I would almost feel better to get over there and maybe take one out on this side, but that's risky. That's very risky, in fact. I mean, I guess... Let's wait for him and take him out in the tall grass in the hope that his pals don't see it. Uh, he's there now. Turn around, please. You're next. <laughs> oh, wait, let's grab the ammo. The guy in the background is worrying me. You think we can just hop in and drive out of here? That's worth a shot. It is. Come on, come back. Move it. Elena, ready. 
Oh shit. Me driving is gonna be the biggest problem. Which way are we going? Yeah, I don't know where we're going, Elena. Fuck off. It's really, really hard to... What? You gotta be kidding me. All of that again? Kill us. I really have no idea where we're going. I think we're going this way. But I'm really not certain. Be. Oh, but that's a, a really narrow turn. We're definitely not going this way. Come on, dude, make a decision. I could go now, but the other two will see me. There's also another one up there. Okay, we just have to be patient. The I think the snipe get taking out the sniper is probably still something that we should consider. Because he can actually get me in trouble. As we saw we have to rush it. Nice! Well, I did not expect that. It actually scared me a bit. Because I didn't see her. You think we can just hop in and 
drive out of here? It's <sighs> worth a shot. We could, Elena, we could. But that's what we should try to do. Elena. Ready. Oh, fuck me. Like, why is that driving so diff- Can't drive. This is... Like, I don't know. I, I'm pressing all the buttons that I need to. Oh, thank God they didn't put us back all the way back. He's the problem. You think we can just hop in and drive out of here? That's worth a shot. I don't know. If I keep dying, it's probably not worth a shot. Nice. Elena, we're gonna do it my way. I'm sorry. My way definitely involves kicking that sniper in the butt. And now we can take our time driving out of this goddamn place. What do we have weapon wise? Fifty-nine versus sixty-two. I do it the cool way. Hey, you see a way out? Up river. There's an opening by the falls. There we go. This is really difficult to drive that thing, by the way. It takes time. Can you go? Please? Especially because the, the water is not helping. Okay, here we go. Going left or right? As so straight or or left? Wow! Check out that elevator. It's massive. Yeah, I'm guessing New Devon's at the top. Then let's get up there. So here's my question. Treasure. It's not like he needs the money. He wants the glory. Doesn't want to be known as a guy who only got rich because of his inheritance. Walking away isn't an option for him. Well, Rafe is a good match for Shoreline. He needs their muscle and they need his money. They do? They seem pretty well stocked. Shoreline got involved in a couple of civil wars that didn't pan out for them. Okay, so that's Nadine perfect. inherited her father's mess. She's probably hoping that this will put her back on the map. Mm. Hey, easy. Easy is for losers. Not sure where to go with the car. It's all a dead end.
Oh, hoppla. Why is there so much stuff in the way? Seriously. Oh, here we go. I think we need to leave the car. Uh, the road continues on the other side. Let's find a way over there. Now, isn't that where we... Okay, hold on. I thought I've been there. And then it was a dead end. So I think it's up here and then... Maybe I missed the right turn. No, see? It's a dead end. For fuck's sake. I don't know how to get there. Oh, here. Oh god. Yeah, this seems safe. Especially when I'm doing it. So far, so good. Keep heading upstream. Bet you could write a killer article about all this. <laughs> I could. I doubt anybody would believe it. Oh, you could take pictures too. I didn't bring my camera. Is this where we're going? So, why do you think Sam didn't come straight to you after Rafe got a lot of I think he wanted to gather every clue that Rafe had on Avery before bailing on him. Plus, he needed time to come up with that crazy Alcazar story. I mean, if I had just looked it up. That is one crazy contraption. That it looks is. big enough to fit the car. Well, here's hoping this one works as well. Wait a second, do we actually go down? We can, okay, interesting. Like, I only got the idea because she said it. We have to get the elevator first. All right, let's look around. Of course not. Would have been too easy. <laughs> the water wheel's still working. Either we fix this thing or we find a way to climb it. Let's see what's what. Okay, we can uh, obviously destroy things. The question is, why would we do that? Well, that's a problem to the water wheel. Ah. I need to get up there and see. So with this I might understand because then we can get up. Yeah. Okay, so we need to destroy these things, which means I need to park the car pretty close to here. And that's what I'm gonna do, and then we gonna end the episode. So we're gonna grab the thing, pull these things down in the hope that the whole thing comes down a little bit and then we can maybe hopefully get in there and fix the water wheel so that the elevator works so that we can get up to New Devon. Okay guys, um, thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you all in the next one, bye bye.